Launched in 2008 through a consortium of physicians from the Children's Hospital Oakland and the Children's Hospital and Research Institute in Oakland, California, the Children's Global Health Initiative works in six continents and 32 countries globally. It's dedicated to sustainable health care for children and their communities worldwide. We started the initiative because over 10 million children die under the age of five each year from mostly preventable infectious diseases. And malnutrition complicates these deaths in about 50% of the cases. Our initiative is also focused on four of the eight United Nations Millennium Goals. And those are to reduce child death, to improve maternal health, to ensure environmental sustainability, and to improve global partnerships. Here in Vietnam, in Phu Tho province, they are partnering with the Vietnamese government in a study to improve the nutrition of pregnant women through the distribution of animal source food supplements. The primary goal of the project is to see whether improved nutrition of mothers-to-be and pregnant women result in healthier babies. Research shows that Vietnamese women are not only malnourished, but are also deficient in nutrients, especially of iron, zinc, vitamin A and B12. Therefore, they will already be nutrient deficient when they become pregnant. Nutritional status during pregnancy is one of the most important factors affecting fetal development and child health from infancy onwards. Poor maternal nutrition is linked to both premature birth and underweight babies, two of the major causes of death in newborns. This research involves 1,044 subjects in 15 communes in Cam Cave District, Puto Province. There are about 50 people based in local villages involved in the research and helping to collect the data and prepare and distribute the micronutrient food supplements to the subjects. Early in the morning, the cooks come to the market and they're looking for green leafy vegetables as well as chicken and other animal source foods, for example, pork. And they take the ingredients back to the kitchen and essentially make a stir fry and pour in the patties into a certain size so that they then have exact proportions to give to the women in the study. The program is sustainable because all the ingredients can be grown locally through the Vietnamese VAC farming system. VAC là một cái hệ sinh thái. VAC is an ecosystem that includes V, garden, A, fish pond, and C, cage or pen to raise animals. The term home gardening is also quite popular and is also referred to as VAC. VAC provides nutritious and safe foods for households. The use of VAC farming helps to make the system economically sustainable and also provides an environmentally sustainable source of vegetables and foods to make the micronutrient food paddies. We hope that supplementing the mother's usual diet with a micronutrient food supplement, ASF, will improve birth weight, reduce preterm deliveries, enhance early infant growth, improve maternal micronutrient status, and reduce the incidence of anemia and infection. This program is good, it's positive. We think it can expand to other provinces with the same condition as the food hall. And also we can introduce uh, this um, program to uh, PM control program in Vietnam. This, it is uh, the national uh, malnutrition control program in Vietnam and it's uh, carried out in city three provinces. We form partners with local and national governments which are cr critical to sustaining any healthcare program that we develop. But in addition, we like to partner with other companies that have technology that is uh, complementary to the expertise that we provide. So for example, we have partnered with Tecla Labs and they are developing a low-cost centrifuge that we can use in the 15 provinces where we're working for our study. In addition, we're, we've been working with the University of California at Berkeley, the School of Bioengineering, where they develop a cell scope. And this cell scope will be used for helping us to detect urinary tract infections in the patients, as well as identify inner ear infections in neonates. This kind of study is uh, very uh, well designed and very useful for Vietnam, since we uh, uh, develop uh, this proposal together and also on a scientific uh, evidence base for this study. And um, uh, through this study, we could learn a lot, the new technique uh, 
from this uh, research team. If we find that the program is a success, it gives us a really good idea of when supplementation will improve pregnancy outcomes. And of course that will have a global impact um, because that will change policy. Um, but I think most importantly, uh, because our program is based on a food supplement that is produced from uh, locally grown vegetables as well as locally raised animals, uh, it's already a sustainable program in Vietnam and, and would be in many developing countries of the world.